Good morning. We are setting up in a cornfield, making some adjustments to the decoys. All the decoys out we got today are from Bulk Decoy Club. So we got the full body mallards and we got the full body goose decoys. And this field was stacked up with some ducks and some geese, more ducks than geese. I don't doubt that we'll get our ducks, but it's been one crazy morning, running around like a chicken with its head cut off, getting everything set up and blind set up and everything. We're trying something that I've never ever done in the history of ever. And I've heard people doing this. I've seen it done on shows and stuff. We're uh, taking two A-frames and just setting them up. If it works, it works. If it doesn't, it doesn't. I've got a feeling it might work. Blake and I went to town on some grass last night. Got these things looking good. We got it really coming up and covering that big gap in the middle of the blind and hopefully keeping everybody concealed. Four spinners, full body decoys. I think we got like six or seven dozen Canada decoys and two or three dozen duck decoys. We'll see what these birds do, make some adjustments if we have to, but it's really foggy. There's more wind than we thought there was gonna be, which is phenomenal. It was saying three miles an hour. We got like seven, so that's enough to really make a big difference. So today, the shells that I'm gonna be shooting is, uh, when, when we get geese coming in, I'm gonna be shooting, where are they at? There they are. I get, you guys have been, asking me if I've been shooting these all season. I haven't, I've only got a few boxes of these. Federal did send me these to show you guys and use them and test them out. So we're gonna be trying out these TSS loads. These are three inch, double B and seven shot. So these are tungsten loads. They hit pretty hard and we got some geese. We got a lot of geese around right now. So those should hammer them. That's about it. We're gonna get locked and loaded in the blind ready for these ducks to start flying and it could possibly get Western. He's coming, he's coming right in front. Shoot him. Shoot him. Nice shooting guys. Well, first mallard came in and came in perfect. Oh my gosh. I saw him, I heard him. I gave him one little call and right in the spread. I've got a feeling we might get some clouds in here. I don't know how long it's gonna take to get clouds and mallards in here, but we'll get some decent groups. But if it's singles like that all day, I'll be perfectly content. Shoot him, boys. I know I got the one on the right. I tried it in the middle, I don't know if I hit how good I hit. One in the middle or the one in the left? <laughs> oh my gosh. Did you hear that? But He shot the one in the middle. Oh, mine's running off. You got a good bird dog. Catch him, Blake. Nice. Nah. A little bloody there, bud. I was sitting down here, taking a sip of coffee, look up, and I see these two ducks coming right in. And I just go, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and oh my gosh. That's a start. That's a good start for today. I can't, maybe it's the fog, but I. I think these blinds in the middle of this field are actually working. I'm amazed. Come from the right, hard. Ready? Shoot him, boys. You just felt that that one, John. His head came off. <laughs> We were both shooting at that one. We just tickled some of them. We had a couple playing, and then I was waiting for them to come back around and center up a little better, and this other group came right in. That was perfect. And John and I were shooting at the same two ducks. We both smacked them. I think John's claiming those. So, we'll keep rocking and roll. Up top, up top. Ready, boys? Kill him! Cut him. Cut him. Let her go! Let her go! Oh, her. <laughs> One more down! Ooh. How you doing, darling? 
this is working out really well. I was pretty confident that we'd get our ducks just because of how many we've seen in here. Geese, that's another story, I'm not so sure. But we'll give it a go. We're stacking them up slow and steady. Off to the left. Coming. Big group. Coming, right over top. Shoot for green, baby. Kill him. That's a decent group. Come on, dude. I stuck a finisher in you and you're flopping around like crazy. Sweet little green head. It's my first one for the bag. Whew. Called them in, worked in perfect. Ideally, what's gonna happen is we shoot all our ducks and we're ready for honkers. That would be phenomenal. We got birds working? Yep. Oh, this'll be fun. They're coming back. <laughs> Ready boys, ready, ready. Don't do that, come in as a group. You gotta aim for green. Shoot him! Shoot him, boys! Oh, 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 I got two in that group. <laughs> John, did you shoot that one that was kind of fluttering down, yeah. kind of slow? Yeah. I whiffed. I didn't shoulder my gun right. That was a decent group. I totally messed that up. I shouldered my gun on the outside of my shoulder, and it was just dumb. So. That was a really good group, and they centered up, came in perfect. We got some great shooting all across the board. We're stacking them up. Oh, hi boys. Hi boys. We got ducks working. In the decoys, two coming in hard. I think that was a hand. He's hanging his head down low. Blake, come here. You know what time it is? It's confession time. Yeah. <laughs> I got excited. <laughs> it's been happening lately. I don't know what's going on. We just love giving you crap. They have drugs for that, dude. It'll make pet. Are ducks, are ducks like deer? The does and the hens taste better? Sure. Yeah. If that makes you feel better. We'll go with that.
Just not as pretty of a picture for you. No, no. I just, I think it's so funny because Blake is so like, only shoot drakes. Like we're all like that, but if you shoot a hen, it's kind of whatever. But I mean, there's nothing better than a five man limit of only green heads, you know? So, I don't know, kind of fun to give Blake some crap. Ducks are working in here way quicker than I expected. Foggy morning, I can't imagine what it'd be like when it's crystal clear out. They'd come in out of no, like just balls of them. They'd see the spread. I wonder, I want to know how many ducks are flying around that we can't see. There's probably a lot. Here we go. Three. I'm done. <laughs> Good job, Joe. Good job. Glad you limited out, buddy. <laughs> so you break some early today. Oh, yeah. Good job. Robert, give me some love. I thought you were going to shoot that one down there. How many ducks you got? Four. You shot all the birds I've had my BB on. That's what he's doing to me. <laughs> Every bird I put my BB on, I wait a second because I know you're going to shoot it. Couple. <laughs> that was a pintail. I shot a Mallard Drake. Yeah, I just one. Some love, brother. Two to go. Number three for me is down. My shooting is nah. It's kind of a poke, but it'll work. So we're getting really close to having everybody's limits. So that's pretty sweet. I'd love to get limited out on ducks and shoot the geese. But, you know, doing pretty good. I could not be any happier about how this is going. I am stoked. Shoot that Drake. What do we got? Oh yeah. No, we had a group off to the left. I was about to double up on that. Yeah. I was about to double up, but my gun didn't cycle. Which that almost never happens. They're number four for me. Oh. You're out. It's not that it didn't cycle. You were out of shells. I was out of shells. <laughs> I had one shell in my gun. Dang it! You're a rookie, huh? Apparently! Let's shoot these ducks and focus on honkers. Oh my gosh. Beep. <laughs> 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 
Blake, you get one up high, I'll get this one. I wasn't close. Did you get yours? I got mine. I limited out of mallards. Three right here, Josh down. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot that one. Oh, here you go, Blake. We just need one. Right there. Right there, right there. Shoot that one. On the right, on the right, on the right, on the right, that one. Widgeon, 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 Widgeon! Now get the drink, Blake. I only had one. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Don't do that. Rip. 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 Shoot that one, Blake. <laughs> I ain't seen one of those all season long. Hell yes. We gotta kill him first. We're done with our ducks. Done with the ducks. Look at that boy. Look at that boy. Oh, that's still Oh my gosh. Done with the ducks. We got a widge in. Oh my gosh. Careful. I was pinned up on that mallard. No. <laughs> yeah. No, dude. I I was so close to grabbing my gun and shooting that thing, but I let you take it. So uh, now we wait for the geese. I don't know cool. where the geese are going. We can hear them flying, but not seeing any. But we got all this fog, so it makes it real difficult. But game plan: we'll s keep everything the same. Pull the spinners out, put them in the bag, and uh, hopefully call some geese in. Five-man limited mallards with a bonus. Widgeon. That was some awesome field ducks. They just, ducks in a field work in, in such big groups, it makes it so much fun. I'm stoked. Shoot him. Shoot him. Nice, nice shot, Blake. We have been seeing group after group after group after group of geese going out to feed. Been trying to get them to come in. Nothing has come. Those four were the closest thing that we had. But we've just been seeing such big groups and they know exactly where they're going. But I've got a feeling that when they're coming back, we might be able to get some to trickle in. But Blake freaking stoned two geese like a champ. Look at this guy. You're a cold blooded killer today. Smoked him in the head. Hell yeah, brother. Two geese. No bands though. We got them. They did that right though. Not really. They did it okay. They came over us. They came over us. A lot better than every other goose we saw. Just needing to come back. And we'll be golden. Bye guys. That's awesome. I really need a Polaris like that. That'd be perfect for uh, what we're doing out here. And uh, so if, if anybody from Polaris or Quack Rack wants to hook, hook a brother up, I got you. And you got me.
we'll take care of each other. <laughs> that ain't gonna happen. But we got a five man limit of mallards, one cotton top, and two honkers. Blake is a stone cold killer today. I'm a little bummed I didn't get to shoot any of those uh, tungsten loads at any geese, but that's how it goes. I was just using three inch two shot black clouds with uh, these ducks, but golly, I'm gonna take you down a trip here. Wham! We got some ducks. Woo! This worked out so well. We were watching this field and it was loaded with ducks. We didn't know how quick they'd come in, but by 8.30 we were done. That's so awesome. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video as much as I enjoyed filming it and hunting it. It was phenomenal. Field mallards are just, they are something that I just absolutely love. We're getting these ducks cleaned up. Look at them, look at all them groceries. Oh, they're so tasty. This hunt was just textbook. You know, we scouted it out. We saw ducks in this field two days in a row. We're like, okay, we gotta get in here and hunt it. And it worked out. And the A-frames just in the in the field, like they were just grassed up really good, set up, and it worked. It worked way better than I figured it would. The geese, I think they knew something was up, but the ducks, they were in there so hot and heavy that I don't think they cared. They just all they all they had their mind on was that corn in that field and they didn't they didn't give a crap. No complaints there. I I honestly, this this hunt was sweet, and this was this was different than any other field mallard hunt that I've been on, other than like one of them. There wasn't very big groups; it was just small groups coming in, just one after another, and it made for a really good hunt. We had some great shooting, and not a lot of these ducks are shot up too bad, which that's always a plus. I mean, I hate cleaning a duck, opening it up, and seeing the breast is just demolished. These look really good, so I think we're shooting them at a good distance. If you guys liked this video, be sure to leave a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. It means a lot when you guys do that. And if you haven't followed me on my social media yet, be sure to do that. I've got Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, and Facebook. So follow me on there and stay up to date with what's going on. But that's all I got for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed today's video, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. <laughs>